seeing things. Have you been attacked by a spirit? Yes. Somebody died here. You know, if he wanted to tell you something, pin you up against the... Oh, I'm absolutely pinning you down. Yeah. You could have quite a struggle with him. On the north shore of Canada's Lake Ontario sits Whitby. In this once abandoned Victorian home, now newly renovated, history is not the only thing lurking in its hallways. We were just taking pictures all around. Because you wanted a before and after because, well, this is the after. This photograph here that has this, uh, this blue cloud in it, it appeared down there in front of the window. Look at it closely. Here, it's definitely an image of a man looking straight at you. The rescue mediums are on their way to investigate. I wonder what the house is, whether it's a small one or big. What do you think? I hope it's a bigger one. We like the bigger one. We do. Even before they bought the property, Homeowners Anthony and Shannon had an unsettling experience. First really crazy thing that happened was before I started with the construction here. And I had this dream that this uh, angry man was walking up Brock Street. And I remember while I was sleeping, I'm thinking, oh geez, he's getting closer to my house. Oh, now he's at my door. Now he's in my house. Jackie Dennison and Christine Hamlet are internationally renowned psychics who spend their days and nights shepherding wayward spirits. And a lot of times I'll feel like there's somebody on the stairs staring at me. It's a very strong feeling. The rescue mediums have been given no prior knowledge of their destination. Even the name of the town has been kept secret until now. But several days earlier, they did have some intriguing premonitions. Frostbite. Th this feels as though this might be a story connected to this with frostbite, somebody who had frostbite. A feeling of being watched, you know, when you, you know somebody from Spirit is, is watching you. Yeah. I know somebody's here. A spirit of a man that's been seen. Yes. And then somebody's seen like a figure or a mist on the stairs. You know when you're sleeping and you, you just know someone's staring at you? While I'm awake, this black energy mask came down these stairs. It touches me and I felt like I was getting mildly electrocuted. It was not a nice feeling. Jackson, Tom or Tommy. In addition to their written premonitions, the rescue mediums have created psychic drawings of what they expect to encounter during their investigation. Yeah, and he's very tight-lipped about yeah. something. <laughs> Do you know as well, we've got a lot of things that refer to photographs, because mm. I keep being drawn back to photographs all the time. Mm. Armed with their psychic tools, Jackie and Christine arrive. That's a very big house. <laughs> I really hope that the rescue medians can come here and, and uh, help identify who the spirits are and direct them to maybe get past being in this house and disturbing us. This is the first time Jackie and Christine have met homeowners Anthony and Shannon. Hello. 
Hello there. Hi. How are you? Oh, cold. 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 The rescue mediums sit down to present their premonitions. The um, premonitions and things, anything that sort of rings a bell with you, anything that you think, oh yes, I know that name, or you can respond to it, you can... The first thing I got was a feeling that you're being watched. Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. A man spirit seen sometimes as a shadow. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, okay. A headless body. <laughs> Headless, like you know, figure. Yeah. Um, no. Are you sure? Me hesitated. <laughs> uh, I, I'm not sure of the that uh, vision that I saw one night in here, so I'm not. I'm not okay. sure. Okay. Okay. Story of somebody who had frostbite. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah. That's unbelievable. Yeah. Go. Okay. <laughs> I'm like really freaked out right now. <laughs> That's really bizarre. You just said that. Okay. Are you okay? Mm-hmm. Do you want to so break for a minute? No, it's fine. Okay. No. Well, well, we'll come back to that in a minute. Mm -hmm. okay. Wow. 